Watson, go ahead. Hey, well, with coming right off of an off day, how beneficial is it just at this time with how you all are doing? How do you use that to reset? Yeah, I mean, yesterday, you know, it was good. Good kind of mental reset, physical reset um, after that series in Anaheim. But, you know, guys, we're all ready to be back today and, uh, and uh, win a ball game today. And what's the game plan for today? Uh, you know, Bueller's going to go out there, give us six, seven, eight, nine innings. Who knows how many? Um, we pretty much count on him to have a good start. And, uh, you know, as an offense, we're going to go out there. We're going to execute our plan and uh, score some runs. Thanks, Will. Questions from Dave Vassay. Go ahead, Dave. Hey, Will, just from your perspective, catcher has the best view of everything. What have you seen from the team that's kind of hurt you guys to be in this position lately? Um, it's, it's a lot of things. You know, it's it's getting late in games and not executing on the mounds when we do have a lead. And then – get behind and we're not executing on offense uh, to get back into the game. Um, you know, we're just not playing great, but, uh, you know, we just got to turn that around and start playing better baseball. Well, your at-bats have been good and the chase percentage is down. Do you kind of feel like this is similar to the start you had last year where you're having good at-bats, just not getting the results, or is it a little bit different this year? Um, no, I mean, I feel like I've been kind of grinding at the plate all year. Uh, you know, trying to make adjustments, um, you know, trying to get better, better contact and, uh, you know, get more hard, hard hit balls in play. You know, if I good games, bad games, I mean, that's baseball, but, you know, I kind of feel like I've been grinding all year. Um, you know, just don't feel, feel great in the box, but, you know, at the end of the day, that, to me, that doesn't really matter how you feel in the box. You just, you got to go and compete, you know, at bat to at bat. And that's what I'm trying to do. Have you started to find that feel in that last series? Uh, yes and no. <laughs> uh, it's baseball, you know. It's When things are going well, usually you feel pretty good. Um, but when they're not, usually you don't feel great. But, you know, personally, I I know it's – I haven't really had my A swing in, in the at box much this year. Um, so it's a lot of, you know, just compete and, uh, you know, try to help the team win. Thank you, Will. Next question is from Eric Steven. Go ahead. Will, uh, at the end of the year in uh, 2018, when, when you were – before you were active, you, you kind of got a chance to spend some time with the team in September. Sort of – I think Dave Roberts called it an apprenticeship. What do you remember about that, and what, what did you sort of gain from that, uh, even though I, obviously you weren't playing? But what, what did you gain from that? Uh, you know, from that, I guess – Kind of got to see what it was like to be a big leaguer. Uh, it's on their schedule. It's in the clubhouse. It was doing stuff for the team. Um, so, you know, that that prepared me for, for 2019 when I did get called up. Um, but I spent a lot of that time, you know, doing some scouting uh, of, you know, the opposing hitters that we were playing. Um, and, you know, kind of coming up with what I would come up with, seeing, talking to guys or talking to, you know, the coaches, I guess. And you know, then get to see it in the game and, you know, kind of match up what I, was that right? Was that wrong? Um, what could I have done differently? What did they do differently in that situation? Um, so it's mainly, mainly probably that, what I took away was just, you know, how to, how to game plan for an opposing team. How did it feel to be on the other side of that, um, you know, earlier this year, and I guess parts of last year when Kbert was up, not active, but with you guys on the taxi squad? Yeah, no, Kbert, Kevin's great. We've I've known him for several years. Played together some. Um, good ball player. Uh, I thought it was awesome. Pinch hit in uh, Chicago. Homer on the first pitch. That was that was awesome. But uh, but yeah, you know it's Barnes and I've been talking to him. Uh, you know, just kind of he's a new guy, and you know we know stuff that that I didn't know as a rookie, or you know he probably doesn't know as a rookie. That you know just kind of talk to him, let him help him figure stuff out and, uh, you know, kind of how to, how to manage the staff. Thanks. Next question is from JP Hornstra. Go ahead, JP. 
Hey, Will, you've been hit by pitches four times this season. Um, coming into this season, you've been hit six times in your whole career. And it isn't just you. Batters are getting hit at a record rate across baseball. Um, but I'm wondering what you're seeing. Are more pitchers throwing inside, throwing with less command, something else? I have no idea. Honestly, I don't even know I've been hit four times. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. It's probably more of a game plan thing against me, pitching me in maybe, or, you know, a lot of – feel like a lot of pitchers are, you know, becoming stuff over command, and that might be a cause. I don't really know. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. I, I did want to follow up, though, on something you said earlier, which is that you hadn't had your A swing much in the box this year. Uh, is that a mechanical issue, or is that just a, a mental lapse on your part? What do you think? Oh, I mean, I definitely don't think it's a mental lapse. Uh, okay. Pretty focused in the box every at bat. Uh, no, it's a mechanical thing. You know, there's so many moving parts, so many things you got to time up and sync correctly. And if one little thing gets messed up, it causes other problems or, you know, you might not know exactly what's causing what. And, uh, you know, it's, that's, that's baseball. It's a game of adjustments. Um, you know, and sometimes your swing might feel great, but the opposing pitcher just, you know, he executes what you don't really handle well. And, you know, that kind of gets exposed sometimes, you know, who knows, but, um, but it's just, for me, it's just sticking to the process, sticking to what I know I do well, um, you know, talking to the hitting coaches, talking to the other players, what they feel, what they don't feel, you know, when, when I'm feeling a certain thing, how do they fix it? Or, or what do they see on video? What do I see on video? Um, you know, it's just a constant conversation with, with those guys and especially the hitting coaches to kind of try to figure it out and get back on track and, uh, and, you know, it's, it's, that's, that's baseball. Next question from Mike DiGiovanna. Go ahead. Hey, Will, just wondering how you feel like Walker is throwing the ball this year. I feel like he's been throwing good. Um, the stuff's there, you know. You know, he's, he's never going to live up to his expectations in his, in his head, you know. He wants to go out there and throw nine shutout innings every game, and that's him. And, uh, and that's, that's the kind of competitor he is. Uh, but – same thing, you know, he's he's working on some stuff. He's trying to get all his pitches back to, you know, that that wipeout stuff that it has been. And, you know, he, he will. Uh, he'll just get, keep getting better this year and keep uh, keep improving. You know, he's still, still a young pitcher, but you wouldn't really think that just kind of knowing him. Um, but, but, yeah, I mean, he goes in every five days, just competes, and it's quality start after quality start. We've got time for one more. Go ahead, Vasily. Hey, well, just one more thing. Um, as far as holding runners on with your relief pitchers, is there anything that can be approved upon during the season? Uh, opponents have stolen over 20 bases from the seventh inning on against you guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, there's there's definitely stuff we can do. We can, you know, mix times to the plate. We can get them quicker. We can slide step. Uh, we can pick over more, not be as predictable with picks or, you know, there's just lots of stuff we can do. And, you know, it's a conversation we've constantly been having with pitchers and, and, uh, you know, we're trying to, trying to fix that and uh, we go from there. Thanks, Will. Thanks everybody.